but my highlight really is popping. Hey y'all, so today's video is going to be my February favorites. Um, can we just talk about how this month has flown by because it literally was like just New Year's Eve and now it's freaking St. Patrick's Day. How is this possible? I don't know. But anyways, I'm going to show you guys what I've been loving pretty much for the month of February and some probably in January too. So they are behind me. I'm probably blocking them, but I'm going to show them all to you guys. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm going to handle random things first and then we're just going to jump into beauty after that. Okay, so the first thing I have been loving is my planner. This is one I got from Recollections or I got it from Michaels, but it's by Recollections and it's very, very, very reminiscent of the Erin Condren planner. So I had the Erin Condren planner last year, but I really was not trying to pay $60 for another planner. So when I went to Michaels... I keep forgetting the name um, they actually had this planner and I flipped it open and I was like holy crap this looks so much like I don't know if you guys can see so this is March um, and it just has like the videos that I want to film for you guys but anyway so it just has like the it's the the what am I trying to say the vertical type they also have horizontal and I have one of those of a happy planner but this is the type that I had of the Erin Condren so this was the type that I got for the recollections one this only retails for like 30 bucks whereas the other one like I said was closer to 60 probably a little bit more because I think I personalized it and that cost more um but then I used this 50% off coupon and got this for like 12 or 13 dollars so if you have not heard of this brand definitely check it out because and if you like the Erin Condren or you're looking for a planner check this one out all right two other randoms are these sunglasses that I got from Francesca's I discovered Francesca's by way of Casey Holmes here on YouTube she got a this really pretty necklace and she was telling everyone where she got it from so I went in there looking for that and while I was in there I actually found these sunglasses and then I kind of was like well let me see what other stores they have and because the, the store I went into only had um it was like a pretty small store so we went to another Francesca's this past weekend and they had these gorgeous nude um mirror sunglasses which I feel like are going to be perfect for the summertime so definitely loving these and I'm loving just the store in general so let's put that on the list too. Alright so the next product is just a hair product and this cute little guy I got back in January and it is a gel. It's the Eco Styler Gel in olive oil and you guys when I tell you that it lays my edges down and it does not move. Y'all. Okay I got this from Sally's. I think it was like a dollar and fifty cents or something. Um seriously okay if you are not on the eco style gel train this is the type to try like i wasn't really before but this one has me like okay okay i see y'all I, I see y'all i might need to need to investigate so the last two body products i have are actually like a combination that i use and i found this via pinterest so it is the cocoa butter body oil gel and then the vaseline intensive care coconut cocoa radiant with pure shape no pure cocoa butter anyway so these two y'all 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 this like it just it makes my skin feel like nas okay my godson like my skin feel like his does like it's, it's unreal how soft it is so i put this on like right after i get out of the shower um and i've like dried off and then once this is soaked in, I follow it up with the Vaseline um, lotion. And it keeps me moisturized like nobody's business. Like, oh my gosh. Okay. I'm saying like a lot, but I'm sorry. It's just like amazing. Okay, so before I actually get into beauty, I want to give three honorable mentions to three beauty products that I just got within the last week or so. And I didn't feel right including them in my favorites because I was like have had them long enough for them to be favorites but i've been loving them this week there's actually a fourth product but i can't find it it's a highlighter that i'm wearing like under this one um in the color iced by ColourPop, and it is phenomenal y'all it's good to my soul okay it's good to my soul so anyways okay so the first product is this it is by ColourPop, and it is just four of their eyeshadows so they came out with these um 
Crushed Shadows here recently. If you guys have not been turned on to ColourPop, let me save your life, okay? It is like thebomb.com. I have so many of their products. It's crazy. But um, they just came out with these products here with pressed powders. And this gold color here is what I'm wearing on my lids today. Let me see if I can swatch it for you guys. Can you see that? Can you see that? Like, hello. Okay, y'all. It's the business, okay? It's the business. So the second product should probably not come as a surprise that it's an honorable mention. It is the palette by Casey Holmes. Um, she came out with a Smashbox collaboration for highlighter palette. It looks like it is for her. And um, I just did a video showing you guys like swatches and stuff. Like I said, it's one of the ones I'm wearing today. Like I. I'm wearing a ColourPop one as a cream and then I set it with the powder so that's why I'm like super glowy I feel like I look super glowy I don't know but I feel like it so yeah so honorable mention I just got it a couple days ago so I can't really say oh it's bomb.com I mean it is but I haven't used it like all month long so, okay third product so lately I have been loving my brows like trying to just like get them perfected and i've been loving this pencil right here it's like super thin i was using one from ulta that was my sister's or is my sister's but she kind of got mad at me so luckily this one just came in time but it's like the same format super thin pencil looks just like the anastasia one which i don't have i kind of want to try it but then i'm just like i might go back to a phase where i don't really care about my brows so do i really want to spend 20 dollars when this was, was only five so been loving this for my brows all right so speaking of brows the other product i have been loving is the ulta brow beauty brow tint and or ulta beauty brow tint in deep it has been like a saving grace it's literally like a brow gel i feel like um i just sweep sweep this in whether i'm doing a natural look whether i'm actually like going all glam like i sweep this in and it just like makes my brows look amazing yeah this plus the pencil it's just bomb all right so we're gonna jump back over to highlighter real quick and this is the nyx away we glow and my voice is cracking i'm sorry y'all so it is a liquid highlighter and it's in the color daytime halo this color y'all so freaking gorgeous oh my goodness it's so gorgeous it's like super natural let me see if I can swatch it. So that's like a liquid swatch of it. And then you just like rub it out. And it's just like the prettiest sheen on your face. Like, okay. You see that? Do you see that? Like, it's just like super, super, super pretty. So yeah so the next product is this one by wet n wild it's just the mega cushion color corrector for dark circles and it's in the color peach um it looks ooh, okay so let's see if i can open it with my these nails on so it looks like this it's just like a cushion and i actually used the little cushion that came with it and i just like put it on underneath all of my makeup so right over primer i put this on and then i put concealer and regular stuff on and it's just like freaking amazing i think it was like six dollars when i got it from walmart um but it is one of the new products i do love it though it's really really good we're gonna wait till louis finish drinking because you know he thirsty So last two products, let's go. The next product I have is this one here by Urban Decay. It is their Perversion Liner, or not liner. I wanna keep saying it's a liner, it's not. It's a mascara, it's so small. I think that might be why I wanna call it a liner. But it is a mascara and y'all, I've been sleeping on this mascara, okay? So it's got this huge wand and it just makes your lashes look amazing, y'all, okay? Amazing, let me tell you. So I tried this out. My sister was like, oh, you should get it. I saw this video where this girl had like bomb lashes 
because we were talking about how I don't like wearing false lashes and she was like well she had bomb lashes and she used the perversion mascara and a couple other ones so you should try it out and see how you like it I was like mm, okay you know I've seen the perversion one I'm not really impressed with it but I'll give it a go so we were in Sephora looking for a face mask which I'm gonna show y'all in a minute and lo and behold she found like this little tube and I was like that's not a big commitment sure I'll try it tried it out as soon as I got in the car I was just like head over heels that day like that day since then I've been using it every day so like every day the last product I have is this right here this baby okay this is like I don't I don't even know I was looking for something because my face has been breaking out like crazy um I don't know if I mentioned it or not but a few weeks ago I went on a trip to visit my friend and I think all of the recycled air from the planes just like destroyed my skin's equilibrium because it's not been the same since then so I've been looking for something to help like kind of re get it back to where it was and this was one of the products that I saw on the Sephora website and I was like that might be something worth giving a shot to so I went in the store and I was looking for like the smaller container of it because I'm just like I don't know if I want to pay $26 for this or not like is it gonna work is it gonna work um so I saw it and I was talking to the lady in there and she was like well of all of them I like that one the best I feel like she probably told me that because she was just trying to make the sale but I ended up purchasing it anyway the $26 one anyways I purchased it and that day I saw a difference like literally that night I put it on so it's a 10 minute mask it's called the origins out of trouble 10 minute mask to rescue problem skin put it on my problem areas that night it cleared up some of the issues not all of them but some of them so I was like okay well let's keep trying this you know I don't want to keep using it because it was really strong but I did want to like keep using it so that my skin would have been clear up so I waited like three days and then I tried it again and I love that it only takes 10 minutes because I have the Indian healing clay and I use that like once every couple weeks or so but it takes like 30 or 40 minutes for it to dry out and then it's just like I don't like it like I like it but I don't like that it takes that long so love that this takes only 10 minutes I can put it on when I first get in the shower and then by the time I get out of the shower or once I get out of the shower I can like wash it off so really 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 fantastic product if you guys are looking for something even for like spot treatments or something like that try this out all right y'all so that concludes my favorites for the month of february really just my current favorites but whatevs um if you guys liked it make sure to like this video hit subscribe if you have not yet and um join my fam because we try and keep it interesting around here i try to upload every monday and thursday so we're gonna try and you know see how that goes my latest video will be floating around here somewhere definitely check it out and um like i said if you haven't subscribed hit that little button somewhere definitely the one down below if not but i will see y'all in my next one